music of the Women's Royal Army Corps Band, Pathé Pictorial is proud to present its own exclusive royal tournament in the open air. Because here, for the first time, the highlights of the great annual event that the three services present have been recorded in colour for all of us to remember and enjoy. First, the Royal Navy. I'm up! Here at a fleet air arm base is reenacted the battle scene on an aircraft carrier's deck. At breakneck speed, a highly organized team races to get the latest air-to-air -air missiles in fighting place. Off comes the protective cover, the noddy cap. Normally, the flight deck preparations are carried out in conditions far from pleasant, with a 30-knot sea spray lashing the carrier's deck. Jet engine's protective shields are whipped away. Underneath it, one of the ground crew feverishly fits the hold back for the catapult. A white painted palouse starts the aircraft engine. Away go the ground crew and out come the flying boys. Pilots on the right, on the left the observer. He sits lower in the aircraft beneath the clamshell cover. The aircraft moves towards the launching catapult. And so, half a million pounds worth of complex machinery, carrying two daredevil airmen, taxes away towards its takeoff stop. The steam catapult, a British invention, has revolutionized war at sea. The launching crew wait to connect it to the piston, which can whip away a 20-ton plane at 130 miles an hour. They need a mile of runway, not 50 yards of deck, to do this on dry land. The bridle's fixed. Thumbs up. It's time for final checks. They're flat on their faces now, the ground crew, and the flight deck officer's flags down for the takeoff.